So there is students today is start problem number 10 NCIT book class 12 integral calculus method of substitution. So problem number 10 1 by root over x square plus twice x plus 2. Now we know the form of integrals. Uh, if the integrals either this form integrals dx by root over a x square plus b x plus c or integration d x by a x square plus b x plus c. If we get this type of integrals, then for solving these integrals, this is the quadratic either root over or without root, then we consider this a x square plus b x plus c this equal to we express x square plus k square x square plus k square or x square minus k square or k square minus x square. So we express this expression, quadratic expression, either this form, this form, or this form. So this is a quadratic form, a x square b x plus c. So we consider convert this. Uh, solution is that integration one by root over x square plus twice x plus two dx. This is quadratic if under root or without root if quadratic then we consider this x square plus twice x plus 2. Then this is x square plus 2 into x into 1 plus 1 square 2 minus 1 square. We convert in uh, perfect square form x square 2x into 1 this is twice x 1 is square is at more and is subtract 1 is square 2 is remain same so this is quadratic uh, perfect square we know a square plus 2ab plus b square this is a plus b whole square this is a square twice a plus b square this can be written as x plus 1 whole square and 2 minus 1 1 so we write here this is dx by root over x plus 1 whole square plus 1 this this whole square now we get this one we assume this is the if coefficient of x is 1 and positive then we consider this whole is x x square plus 1 square but we know this formula integration dx by root over x square plus a square this equal to log base e x plus root over x square plus a square plus c we know this formula so if root over x square plus a square we get then log, log base e x plus root over x square plus a square so this is we assume this whole is x, x square plus a square. This will be log base e x plus 1. This is x square. And this one, x plus 1 whole square plus 1 square plus c. And this is log x plus 1 plus and if we expand this this is x plus 1 whole square plus 1 square this is this one this becomes from this we write x square plus twice x plus 1 plus c and this is our final answer now we consider problem number 11 11 also this quadratic form this form if we have this form then we convert either this this or this so this is we convert this solution is that 
integration 1 by 9x square plus 6x plus 5 dx. So 9x square plus 6x plus 5. This can be written as 3x whole square. So this 6x, this is positive term. We convert this a square plus twice a b plus b square this is a plus b whole square we know this so this is a square 2 a b plus b square 5 minus 1 square and this is a square twice a b plus b square means a plus b whole square 5 minus 1 this is 4 so this can be written as dx by and this whole we can write twice x plus 1 whole square plus 4. So we get coefficient of x is 3. If coefficient of x is 1 and positive then we taking direct formula. Directly consider whole is x. But here we get coefficient is 3. So let 3x plus 1 equal to z. ddx of 3x plus 1 dz by dx. We get this one. Now this will be 3 into 1 plus 0 dz dx 3 dx equal to dz and dx equal to we get 1 by 3 dz so putting this value here dx means 1 by 3 dz and this is z square plus 4 means 2 square and 1 by 3 taking outside dz by z square plus 2 square. We get this one. Now, this equal to, we know direct formula, integration dx by x square plus a square. This is 1 by a, 10 inverse x by a plus c. We know this. So, x square plus a square formula 1 by a 10 inverse x by a that means z by 2 plus c and this is 1 by 6 10 inverse z, z means 3x plus 1, 3x plus 1 is z by 2 plus c and this is our answer 1 by 6 10 inverse 3x plus 1 by 2 this is our answer so we consider 12 number problem solution in 12 number problem integration dx by root over 7 minus 6x minus x square again we get under root we get quadratic this form if we get this form, then we convert either this, this or this. So, 7 minus 6x minus x square, taking minus common, then x square plus 6x minus 7 we get. And our aim to convert in perfect square, this form. So, this is x square 2ab plus b square minus 7 minus 3 square. So, this this 6, this 3 square and we subtract 3 square. This this cancel minus 7 and this we get. And this is a plus b whole square formula a square twice a b plus b square a plus b whole square formula 7 minus 9. Then we get x plus 3 whole square minus 16 
multiplying by minus sin 16 minus x plus 3 whole square. So, this implies dx by root over 16 means 4 square. So, we get this. Now, uh, we know this formula dx by integration dx by a square minus x square equal to sin inverse x by a plus c. This is this formula a square minus x square sin inverse x by a plus c. So, this is coefficient of x is 1 and positive. So, we consider this whole is x a square minus x square. So, this will be sin inverse x by a this plus c and this is our final answer sin inverse x plus 3 x plus 3 by 4 plus c this is our answer. So, dear students these are a nice solution very easy just you have to remember if either this form or this form then we express x square plus k square, x square minus k square or k square minus x square. Ultimately, answer will come. So, if you are feeling easy, then if this solution is very easy, then please like this video. And if you are new in my channel, then please subscribe my channel and click the bell icon. Thank you.